Greetings, dear seekers of wisdom. Today, we embark on a unique journey, one that will take us across the vast expanses of the world's oceans to the isolated lands that lie within. We will traverse the serene turquoise waters and navigate through the whispers of the wind to reach our destination, the islands of thought. These isolated cultures, untouched by the hustle and bustle of mainland life, have nurtured philosophies that are as profound as they are unique. The seclusion, the intimate bond with nature, and the rhythm of the sea, have given birth to wisdom that remains largely unexplored by the rest of the world. Imagine the sight of these islands, nestled amidst the undulating waves, radiating a sense of tranquility. Now ask yourself, does isolation breed wisdom? Let us delve deeper into this question and explore the philosophical ethos of island cultures. The inhabitants of these isolated lands have formed their own worldviews, informed by the unique challenges and opportunities of their environment. The sea, for instance, is not just a body of water to them, but a living entity that dictates the rhythm of life. It is revered, feared, and respected all at once. This relationship with nature has created philosophies that deeply respect the intricate balance of the ecosystem. In island cultures, time often takes on a different dimension. The ticking clock of the mainland is replaced by the rhythmic ebb and flow of the tides, teaching islanders the art of patience and the virtue of living in the present. They have developed philosophies that embrace transience, accepting change as the only constant, much like the ever-changing sea around them. The isolation also fosters a strong sense of community. Islanders realize the value of collective cooperation and harmony, leading to philosophies that place a high emphasis on social cohesion and mutual respect. They understand that every wave, no matter how small, contributes to the might of the ocean. Throughout history, we have seen glimpses of these island philosophies resonate with the thoughts of great minds. The Stoic philosopher Seneca's teachings echo the islanders' respect for nature and acceptance of life's vicissitudes. Similarly, Eastern spiritual leaders like Buddha and Lao Tzu also emphasized harmony and balance, much akin to the islanders' way of life. In contemporary times, as our world grapples with environmental crises and societal discord, these island philosophies hold immense relevance. The philosophical underpinnings of sustainability, harmony, and resilience found in island cultures offer valuable insights into the path we might need to adopt for our survival. Yet, these philosophies are not without their critics. Some argue that they may not be applicable to the larger, complex societies of the mainland. Others question if this wisdom is merely romanticized due to the allure of the exotic. However, it's essential to remember that all philosophies are born out of specific contexts and carry within them the seeds of universal wisdom. Understanding the significance of island philosophies in the present world is vital. As we face unprecedented challenges, the wisdom of these isolated cultures can serve as guiding beacons, illuminating our path towards a sustainable, harmonious, and resilient future. As we bring this exploration to a close, let us remember that wisdom comes in waves, washing onto our shores from all corners of the world. It is in the amalgamation of these diverse philosophies that we find the true essence of our collective wisdom. Thank you, dear seekers of wisdom, for embarking on this journey with us. Your intellectual engagement is truly valued. Now, to foster continued engagement, ponder upon these questions. What can we learn from the islanders' relationship with nature? How can their sense of time alter our approach towards life? Can their community ethos provide solutions to our societal discord? Hold these thoughts close as we look forward to our next philosophical exploration. Until then, let the wisdom of the islands guide you, and may their tranquility find a home within you. And so, as the sun sets on our island of thought, let us remember that no wisdom, however isolated, is beyond our reach. Let us continue our pursuit of knowledge, undeterred by the vastness of the sea, ever eager to explore the islands of wisdom that lie in wait. Until we meet again, fare thee well.